Hi, hi, my beautiful people. Welcome back again to my YouTube channel. I'm Christine. It is another lovely day. And in this channel, we do videos of things that are happening in our everyday lives. Today, we want to <laughs> handle a very sensitive topic uh, that is uh, affecting us with our children as parents. And um, I have my friend here. Uh, my name is Lydia, Lydia Sowa. Mm -hmm. I'm a public health officer. Mm -hmm. And uh, today, <laughs> we want to find out the reason as to why uh, the child abuse has just gone so far. It is just too much. Yeah? Child, parents abusing their own children. Uh, the ch children are even being abused in schools. As you can see, most of the videos that are viral, most of us have seen those videos going around and I don't really think it is a good thing. So we want to tackle this topic a bit and uh, we understand ourselves as the reason as to why these things are happening in the first place. Lydia, can you take us through? <laughs> as, yeah, um, thank you so much. Uh, I think if we start with this tender age, that is zero to five years, most of this age is as is an a learning age mm -hmm. so parents or caretakers or people whom we live together even in schools we need to be we need to, i mean uh, those people need to be very careful in whatever social behavior that they are having or they are doing mm -hmm. if i give you an example like in at home if a parent or maybe parents do smoking and this five-year-old is always seeing the dad smoking. The dad doesn't have a, a, a smoking zone. Mm. He does it in the sitting room. He does it in, in the everywhere. veranda, everywhere. Mm. So this kid, and maybe even those, the, the bats and the, the, the cigarettes boxes are just left at a, a place where it's not secretive. So even one day, you'll find that kid doing the same. Trying. Trying yep. to smoke. However, maybe won't won't light the bat or maybe won't light the cigarette, but in the end of the day, this child is going to cope because this child is in a learning point, is an a learning age. Mm -hmm. Step by step, this child will keep on trying, trying. Eventually, you'll be one day surprised and be told in your school, I mean in his school or her school that your child is smoking. You'll be shocked. You'll say, where, where is my child? I've never, I don't, we don't do this and that, but it starts, it has a start. It started with it the parent. It started with the parent or it started with whoever the keeper of that child for a certain period of time. Mm. It could be the house girl, could be the house boy. The oh, uncle. The uncles. So someone, ha, someone somewhere has started, this behavior is when this child is. Is is took seven from, years. He took it. Yeah. He took it. The he took the behavior from this child, from this adult. Person, yeah. yeah. Okay. So maybe if I also give an, another example, um, sometimes if I give it a flashback, mm. there's a time when people are sharing. How did you start drinking? You know, like those are my brothers and cousins. Then they one of them gave an example. He said, uh, in our house, people used to have parties. These parties, by then, them they are minors. They are, they are, I mean, they are not allowed to take heavy drink. So yeah. what they do when they are told to, to take the bottles away, and you know, beer used to be cheap by then. So people, someone want to drink to, to, to the to, to the end of the of that the, that beer. Mm -hmm. Something will remain. So these boys and girls will take the, the 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 bottles that are remaining, put put in one bottle until the bottle is full. Or halfway. Or halfway. <laughs> and this person, this is where this this person started the, the started beer, yeah, yeah. Mm -hmm. alcohol drinking. So you'll be surprised that your your son, mm -hmm. your teenage boy is is now on alcohol. You, you you start getting a shock or maybe starting to punish, but there's a start somewhere. There's a start somewhere. Yeah. And uh, what about uh, these young families? Our let's say for, for example our daughters and uh, our daughter-in-laws or whatever. Our children and their children and our grandchildren. What is happening? Because the 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 it's like they're abusing their own children these days. They, they, they just see as if these children 
They are the ones who are giving them trouble, are the ones who have caused so many problems to them. Yani, it's like they were not even ready to receive these children and they are in marriage. They are married to one another, they, are, they want to start a family, but they, they are so cruel to the children, yani, they are abusing the children. What is the cause of this thing, surely? What is happening? I think, um, if I may say, to my perception, uh, marriage, marriage is a bond. Most of our recent marriages, this bond maybe uh, is due to something. Maybe the pregnancy, some marriages you find that maybe our parent, my parent and the, the guy's parent uh, happen to have met us and they make us get married, especially mm. with Muslims. Mm. So there's no there's no love there. There's, there's no, no love. love. There. Yeah. Most important thing is love. Mm. Second thing is I, I don't know your sword. I have to know one's strengths, one weaknesses, you know, to be able to be together. Because if like uh, if if my husband didn't read me, mm. you know, if we didn't we we, we court uh, it's called court, courtship courtship yeah. yeah that courtship you didn't do it maximally mm. to know one another deeply mm. the advantage the, the whatever yeah. likes dislikes yeah, and what are you and you just met for a very short time or you were pushed to get married because it's now your time your mother sees you now you can leave get. Yeah, you can go out and get married. Yeah, and, uh, the right time. Yes, the right time. Yeah, it's now the right time now to go. But you are not ready. You don't love the person you are going to marry. Mm. I think those are the some. Those are the challenges. Yeah. Now they do regression to the kids. The kids. Now, but yes. someone is just from work. I mean, something has happened at work. But when you come home, you end up penalizing the the babies or the boys and the young boys and girls who maybe your daughter, your your son, you just mad about nothing. Nothing. Yeah. Or something you know best known to you alone. Yeah. Or something not that the child, you put this not child. anybody who is in the house. You yes. know where you came yeah. with that thing. Some some of them some who don't have kids and I mean daughters and and, and sons, they can even kick a cat. Nepata paka me pigwa cheke. <laughs> I may cause, I may cause destruction, pale, because there's no, there's no love at that time. Yeah. yeah. You know, and then there's this habit of napata young parents. Mm. Um, uh, maybe the wife, uh, the husband has has arrived. Mm. You want to to talk to someone. I mean, you want to talk to your husband politely. Ah, karibu mume wangu, di di di, something something. Mm. Maybe the kids are there, but you are mad, and then you just end up saying, snapping words in front of your kids, mm. showing them that at that time you're, you, you're not happy. You're not happy, yeah. There's something There's wrong. There's something wrong. Mm. So even the kids won't even realize is it about our mother or is it about yeah. where this person is coming from? Mm. So it causes a lot of tension mm. or stress mm. in, this, in, the, in the teenage mm. age. Do now want to say sometimes, um, it's not like our time. Our time, I would always love. You would, you won't hear at Baba napenda boy, girl, ama mama napenda. You know, this is such fathers. Such yeah, person, you know. Uh, when it is love, it is love for all, all the children, children that are there, uh, for both parents. But these days, because boys are so so closer to them to the mothers, mm. so they wouldn't like the father snapping at the mother, so mm. they are closer to them. To the mother. Yeah. So it's so sad because these days you can find that even elderly people now they are divorcing. There are people who are so old, you see, women running away from their marriages. And this thing, I want to highlight something here. When you are the, this you, you are doing these things, I don't say that I'm perfect, it cannot happen to me or whatever. But when once we are doing these things and our big children those adults are seeing us we are destroying these children our kids emotionally because maybe they feel that should they should not tell us that mom dad what we are doing is not right don't do this they get into the the fight that we are doing and uh, to separate us or, or what but we are destroying our own children when they are adults and there is nothing that is so bad like destroying your own children once you are they are grown up now 
And uh, this is where your child, who has not been in drugs, can find himself getting into drugs so that these things, he, 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 she may not be listening to these things or remembering how this family where they have been has been so good and now it reaches a time whereby they, they have no future, they have no family, they, they, are, they are the talk of the village, they are the talk of the whatever, they are the talk of the mta. Yeah, yeah, that's true. <laughs> so they, they get so ashamed, so they cover themselves by they get putting they, themselves into drugs into drugs and so on even your girl can run away get married to anybody or just do some very crazy crazy things yeah, yeah. It's true. and then you find that you are now losing your children through these things that you created and the things that you parents are doing in this house assuming that your children are not seeing these things and they're seeing them and they are affecting them Mm, so true. and most of most most of such uh, situations mm. make even they can even make this teenage if it's a girl mm. she 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 will never dream of getting married you know mm. if she can see the parent one maybe the mother is being beaten mm. or maybe the, the mother there's no love mm. mother is every time maybe the dad is not uh, there is never even there for, for the mother mm. yeah even for them or something and in even if it, it happened, it, it also happens the other way around. Even moms can be having such a very bad character around that these people are only seeing the dad. Mom is ever, ever Busy. With, the, with her bag moving everywhere, you see. Hmm? You don't settle in your house. <laughs> you don't yeah. even have time to cook for your family. You are always traveling. You are always around, moving around. You don't want to stay in your house. So, so it, it, it cut across. It is cut across. <laughs> it cut across for both, both parents. Uh, so yeah, it's true. For, for actually, we just need to try our level best because family is just a gift from God. Once God has given you a family, just try. Let us try our level best. There's nobody who is perfect. Everybody has a challenge. Everybody has a character. Yeah, uh, sometimes it can... <laughs> It can go the other way around, but yeah. just try to connect yourself, remembering that you, you have a family to take care of. Yes, because we need these people. We need to see them in future that they are so and so, yeah, and uh, not to be a laughing stock around. So let us try our level best to do our work. It is a call. As I'm parents. Not, yes, it is a call. It is. It, it is. is a call. So yeah. you have to do it in the last minute that is when they'll also take care of you when you are now so all there's so many things that you cannot do when god gave you children that is the time now they will be taking care of you just if you did your work well True. just try we just try that is it has been a very sweet topic and i think we can discuss and discuss and discuss and we shall come back again mm -hmm. to discuss more and more Please kindly like this video, kindly subscribe to this channel if it is your very first time. I say thank you so much, Lydia, for joining me in my channel so that you can highlight some things that are happening in our homes. Thank you, thank you. Yes. Uh, it's true. Thank you so much. Seeing you again in our next video as we say bye-bye. Bye. -bye. bye.